uh, we we're just so spoiled at this point that we have this amazing like like effects with the dragon. We have these amazing shots, this music, and we're just like, yeah, like it's not like. I feel. Does that mean we're more sophisticated as an audience? Where it's like, but the symbolism, the symbolism, and the the story was rushed, and it's like millions of people talking about like these film school things. Like, are we getting more sophisticated, or are we just like, uh, is Game of Thrones just like this special 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 beast? I, you know, maybe it's a good thing. Maybe it's a good thing that we're all paying attention now to the quality. Um, you know, I wish that were. I, you know, they're, they're making, uh, I was going to say they make less shit movies these days. You know, they're making more good movies, but that's not necessarily true because they're all based on something else. <laughs> it's just like, it's easier to not fail at something horrible when it's like, oh, we got Lion King. Get, I like, you know, John Favreau is amazing and he's going to be, uh, you know, uh, looking forward to the Mandalorian, by the way, that looks amazing. So side note, but, uh. You know, it's 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 harder to fuck it up if it's something that's that's proven to work in the past. That's why they keep doing it. Um, which you uh, you hate reboots. I do, and we won't need to talk about that. But it's uh, I feel like uh, if there's any if there's anything that uh, that comes to to men in his nightmares, it's reboots, the evil reboot. Yeah. <laughs> not that they're not good, but why? Why what, make what, it? What is your most hated reboot right now? that's coming out that you're just like why no why oh I think I told you about this yeah. um it wasn't Hellboy we already had the discussion about Hellboy it was something else yeah. what was it oh it pissed me off <laughs> what was it I told you about this like a couple weeks ago well it was Stephen was it Stephen King no or was it oh it was something uh uh Oh my God! What was it? It was something. Uh, it was something black related, wasn't it? I say that very condescendingly. <laughs> I didn't feel like. I mean, like the main what character is it? a black person. Oh my God! Yeah. No, it was. I. Right. It was. It was not Shaft because I think that actually no, looks good. That, and that's, that's like. That's a like a sequel. sequel. So yeah. That's yeah. I mean, I'm cool, I'm cool with sequels. I'm pretty sure that the main character was a black person, a black guy. <laughs> If it's not, I'm just a terrible human being, but no, I think it was. Yeah, it's it's just no way. I think I'm right about this. It's Candyman. Yeah. (laughs) I knew it. I was like, Tony Todd, motherfucker, why did I not, why did I not remember this? Tony Todd, they're replacing Tony Todd with a new Candyman. That's what it was. Yes. I was right. Oh, it was something poor, too. Yeah. What, wow. if, what if you were just like it stars a white guy it's a reboot oh no <laughs> well we're fucked I wasn't sure I just I was like was it a horror movie yeah Jeez Candyman Louise. Candyman that's gonna suck Tony Todd's amazing I don't care how Candyman's he, I don't awesome care who playing and we're gonna Candyman. reboot it who do you think it's gonna be Chadwick Boseman <laughs> somebody Ken, uh, uh, Tony uh, Todd is like 6'6 six, six. yeah he's, he's got the best tall. voice he's yeah. got one of the best voices of anybody what uh Okay, let's play. Let's do this he was exercise. Amazing in Final Destination. Oh right, you know, little, right. Little two minutes of action every movie. <laughs> He's in Twenty Four, by the way. He plays oh. two different characters, maybe three different characters in Twenty Four. He like shows up randomly, and then later on, he's a bigger character, like completely a different guy. They're just like, he's awesome. Bring him back. Yeah. Who would you get? Who would you get to be Candyman? If not, you know, if you had to, you don't even want to think about it. It's too. It's too fresh. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a fucking dagger right to my ribs.